Hey everybody, I'm Francisco Thurston here with AfterBuds TV, and I'm here with Louis Van Amstel. Hi. Hi. I freaking love your choreography all the time whenever you're on the show. I'm like, Louis choreographing. Well, choreographing for great dancers yeah. makes choreographing a lot easier yeah. and a lot more fun. Mm -hmm. And you can really change things to make them spicier or more skillful. And Jenna and Rudy. Oh. Too hot to handle. Yes. <laughs> Did you know Rudy had kind of like a little bit of ballroom backroom because he's coming from Miami? Yes, I know because I had his best friend in week one and meet the top 20, Nick. And so they grew up having done ballroom. Yeah. But I made it competitive ballroom. Yeah. And he has never done a competition in his life. Okay. But what I thought was fun is that he has a Cuban heritage, charges from Cuba. So yeah. I thought, let me go into his own heritage. I don't even know if he knows anything about his own <laughs> heritage. But he actually did. Yeah. He did. And he tapped into that. And that, all that Cubanism, macho chism, yep, it came out. Yes. It was it was hot and Jenna, she's crazy. Like oh my gosh, such a trained dancer. But what was fun about Jenna? She's so trained, and you know her from last season. Very serious, mm -hmm. always very serious, on point, and she kind of let loose. Yeah, and that's kind of Rudy had that effect on her. Yeah, and it's lovely to see. Yeah, I mean now she's not competing, so now she can kind of like let loose and just dance and like get into it. It's kind of a great point you make because we were talking the choreographers that all the all stars brought the best out of the competitors yeah. this 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 night yeah it was just crazy good crazy yeah. good that's what i was telling um to like nigel and i was like all stars really elevates the entire competition like these dancers get on stage with people that they've watched on the show before yeah. and now they're dancing with them yeah well i guess the stress they don't have they don't have to wait if they're through or not yeah. if they're in the bottom if they're surviving they know mm -hmm. they actually get paid now yeah. so hey, hey <laughs> it's a paid job <laughs> I mean, that's a nice way to come in. Um, ballroom, how do you, like, week after week, you know, we see ballroom. How do you, where do you get your ideas from? Where does your inspiration come from? Because, you know, you want to make it amazing. But, I mean, the choreography is amazing, but where do you pull your ideas from? For me, music is a big deal because, well, people see, mm -hmm. but also people hear. Yeah. So if what they see and what they hear makes sense it automatically is perceived as a great choreography right. and to me the nuances in the music the changes of of the crescendos in the music to me i create rhythms around what i hear mm -hmm. and then of course it's the chemistry between the dancers focus on that right it doesn't matter if they wear a garbage bag or if they have very simple uh simple steps it's the way they pull it off yeah. really that's in the end it's giving them the tools with your choreography that I mean I can't believe we're watching Ru Rudy right there I know. being a goofball again. Anyway, sorry, we're just <laughs> it's okay. You kind of see my him distracting <laughs> us. Um, I would love to see someone dance in a trash bag, just cha cha, trash bag, cha cha. Well, <laughs> sometimes you get people that are dressed to the nines, yeah, but they don't behave it, yeah. And then people, you, they wear ten dollar clothes and they wear it from the inside out. That's what it's all about. So. And you're teaching them how to do something that professionals have been learning how to do it for years. That's the crazy thing about ballroom is that some people have trained in ballroom growing up, but you guys have a really big re responsibility teaching them something like that. Yes, it's very hard to fake. You can do social ballroom dancing and look authentic, but to do ballroom competitive dancing, it's such a unique technique. Mm -hmm. And with Rudy, I almost forgot that he was a contemporary dancer. I mean, what a great job did he do yeah. tonight. And that's why he's excelling in the competition. Um, yeah. Can awesome. You yeah. Can you tell everyone at home, buzz you later? Buzz you later.